So if we select our tool, um, we're going to go into our core box tool. So let's select that tool, and this is going to be tool number three, okay, for this process. Where is the start and end position of this spiral? It's going to start at five. It's going to end at 13, okay, same positions. So five, 13. So how many starts? And so we'll put one. And the spiral pitch is 3.25 inches. 3.25. And the section diameter this is all turned on to is the same diameter section here of 2.5 inches for that core box. So 2.5 inches, and we are done. And so let's generate our G-code. Now let's go to the machine. It comes to the starting position and plunges for our first roughing pass and travels down the stock while rotating. The distance it travels per rotation is leaving that flat gap left over for the core box cutter. At the end of this first spiraling process, you can see that it lifts up and then rotates that 180 degrees, repositioning it for the next cutter. The ability to control the pitch in a spiraling toolpath really opens up a lot of versatility when it comes to these types of techniques. All the cutting advantages shown here are automatically implemented into CCAM Pro.